morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world, we made it. It's time for an edition of Victory in Sight. Father God, as we come this morning, this evening, this afternoon, our brothers and our sisters around the world, we come, Father, to lift your holy name. We come to say thank you for another year, another season, another reason that we are here. Thank you, Lord, for delivering your people who are called by your name. We come this morning, Father, to break bread. We come this morning, Father, to lift you. We come this morning to gift you. For you said it in your word, where two or more are gathered in my name, there I am also. So we feel your presence. We feel you. And we come this morning to lift, to lift your holy name. You said it in your word. If I be lifted, I will draw all men, all women unto me. We come this morning, Father, to say thank you. Thank you for your loving son, Yahshua, Jesus Christ. Thank you for the soldiers who continue on the battlefield fighting for you, Lord. Today, someone has a cancer, an affliction, or an addiction. We ask that you eradicate it right now in the mighty name of Yahshua, Jesus Christ. Father, we will be sure to give you all the honor, all the glory, and all the praise for you and you alone. You and you alone are worthy to be praised. And we claim the victory right now with an amen, amen, and amen. We're here. We are here. We have crossed over another River Jordan. The journey continues. The fight continues. The battle continues. I want to leave you with a thought right now. Even when the Israelites got to the other side, guess what? The enemy was still there. They still had another battle. They still had another fight. Oh, yes, God had delivered them to the land of milk and honey. But even on the other side, my brothers and sisters, they had to keep their focus on God. They had to keep their eyes on the prize, which is our Lord, Yahshua, Jireh. They had to keep lifting. They had to keep gifting. They had to keep fighting, even on the other side. So I don't want you to get too comfortable as a child of God this morning because we have a lot of fights ahead. We have a lot of battles ahead. But guess what? We have a lot of victories ahead. We have a lot of overcoming ahead. We have a lot of triumphs ahead. That's what we do as the children of God. We overcome. We continue in the fight. We continue in the battle. We continue in the struggle. We continue overcoming. We continue being triumphant. We continue keeping the victory in sight. How do we do that, my brothers and sisters? We continue our focus. You hear me? We continue our focus on God. We continue rightly dividing his word. In this word, there is victory. In this word, there is overcoming. In this word, there is triumph. In this word, there is God. And while you focus on this word, the spirit of the Lord continues to fall upon you. Do you hear me? The spirit of the Lord continues to fall upon you. To our brothers and our sisters around the world, wherever you are, Continue to focus on God. Continue to lean not toward the ways of this old world, 
but continue to focus on the ways of this old word. Because guess what? This word has never failed the people of God. This word has never let us down. This word has continued to strengthen us in the struggle. This word has continued to strengthen us in the fight. This word has continued to strengthen us. Don't fall short of reading a scripture a day. Don't fall short of finding some inspirational words of God or from God to lean you toward victory. We've come a mighty long way. Today is January 1st, 2023. And if you're within the sound of my voice, you know that our God is a strong deliverer and he will continue to deliver his people who are called by his name. Know that. Claim that. And until next week, until the next battle, until the next fight, keep, you hear me? Keep the victory in sight. Are you ready for the victory? I'd like to invite you to purchase my books and my CDs on Amazon.com. I have 10 books on Amazon.com. They will lift you, they will gift you, and they will prepare you for the storms that are sure to come your way. Are you ready for the victory? Go to Amazon.com. Christopher Urban, 10 books, two powerful CDs, which are going to take you to the next level in the fight. Take you to the next level in the war. Take you to the next level in the battle. Get ready for the victory when you go to Amazon.com. Purchase my books and my CDs. And let's win this battle together. To God be the glory. For those who know the story. God bless you.